So maybe you are looking for very unique knives. It's brought to you by Tools for Gents. For the real gentleman, you know. Okay. This, this ain't enough. Yeah, it's got a damn sharp edge, but that's just a part of it. This is a tool designed to be a crowbar with an edge. Something we've been calling a knife like the Becker BK2 for years. This knife is so ugly that we'd never buy it ourselves. But in stepped kbar.be and bowevents.be and they sent us this knife knowing we'd put this knife through hell. Like we have never done before. No, they didn't pay for this. But let me tell you, we are forever thankful because this thing... This thing is a monster, and I like it! You know what the first test is gonna be? You, with your very heavy body, are gonna stand on this knife. Dat was heel eng. Nee, dat ga ik niet doen. Oké. Okay. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing? No. But it was very scary. Hey. You know, this actually is just like a big chisel. You know, it has like the Japanese chisel grind. But it's also like a chisel on the front. Look how clean. That came up. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Using this thing as a chisel might not even be that crazy. And so we rushed ourselves to our favorite tree with fatwood lumps to see if it was easy to chisel out a lump as a whole. Fat wood heaven, dude. That is a really nice piece. All right, make it to me. This already really feels like a tool, kind of more than a knife. But we broke the baton last week, and I'm thinking that this knife could be really great for making batons. Oh, Mickey, we totally forgot the bloody sharpness test. Oh no, DBK is dropping to make your nice hair popping. DBK yeah, is just to come. clean it off a little bit now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking about DBK dropping, please visit our shop. We've restocked almost everything. Get ready to be scammed, Joe. Ready, Fred? Oh! Okay, that is pretty neat for like a beast thing like this. Can it shave actually? Oh, it can. So that is actually impressive for a bloody crowbar. <laughs> Um, I don't think we've ever made a baton this fast. No. To be honest. Especially not without a sole. I think, I think it's good enough. The best ever. No, maybe not the Say best. Say yes. Yes, it's the best ever. And now it's time to let it shine. So ah! <laughs> <laughs> that was very It was like an explosion. Intense. It was like an explosion. Jesus! So that was heavy? Yeah, eh? Well, try it again. Oh my god! Oh, this was this had knots. Okay, piece of oak. Let's try a piece of oak. This is really heavy piece. Okay, go for it. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is all just fooling around. Play wood. Child baby wood. Martin, what I'm getting at is a piece that even your splitting machine couldn't split. No. Hello, that, baby. <laughs> there, that is all splittable, Vic. Do 
you love me? Oh, I hate you. I believe that this is possible. Yeah. I never took In a million answer. years. A piece is coming off at least. Fat chunky boy. It's gonna be a tiny fucking chunk. No, it's gonna be good and it's gonna be very impressive for this video. And there it comes! The mother of all pieces! He has done what no man has done before! Yeah, the batoning was amazing. Not the best ever because it is flat on one side, which will make it go sideways. May also be the reason why it splits the softer wood so extremely well. You can call this a big bad knife, alright? Look at this chopping for instance. Okay, Mickey, so why are we cutting a live tree? Because uh, these had to be trimmed down for the life and the forest to come up. Yeah. Now they're getting too big again, so I'm going to trim them right back down, let's see. It's American oak and not native species. Oh, focus. Oh wait, K bar is also American. Whoa! Whoa! Look at that! Whoa! That is a very deep chop for a knife this thick. Whoa! Jesus! It is not sharp, it is just big, stupid power. <laughs> Big chunks, damn! The problem with this tool actually starts with fire making. Now, feather sticking is re really not good. But it doesn't matter because with a knife like this, you have to approach fire making in a different way. So, for instance, we have the fat wood we um, saved that we gathered there. Scrapings. <laughs> Then maybe uh, just shavings. Oh yeah, nice chunks. And this is another problem. So is this knife good for fire making? I don't think so. For firewood no. gathering? I do think so. I, I'm, I'm gonna try to make a fire with the remains of yesterday, so. Use the, yeah, the. The serrated, no, even that doesn't really work. So I'm using the edge right now. Not being nice to it. Okay. If it wouldn't have been this drought, I don't know if fire making like this would have been that that easy. No, no, no. Maybe it would have would have even been impossible. <laughs> Special knife. Special pen. That hurt, didn't it? <laughs> A little bit. That is the thickest pen we have, and we saved it for this knife. Yeah. The pen is absolutely mental. That pen was absolutely mental, how thick that was. And uh, I can't get it out. Oh man. Yeah, are we gonna do this? Yeah. That is crazy thick. Can you see that? Yeah. It has nothing. It has nothing. Vicky, let's go next level. Try bone. But see who dick it is. Yeah. 
Ja, dat is niet normaal. See, it is still see, shaving. Do you see that it still shaves a very tiny bit? Yeah, that is crazy. After cutting through a pen. After cutting through a pen. Yeah, that is bloody mental. The edge has a little minor bend in it now. But that's not a trace cutting a piece of steel. That is probably six times the thickness. Well, Mickey. Oh, the number one knife damager. We proved it last week. It has nothing. Nothing? N what do you mean nothing? It has nothing. <laughs> Still, <laughs> not much. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> How? I look. That's hard. Yeah, I mean, I think it damaged my ears more than it did the knife. Look! Uh, I don't look, know. Look, it has a, lo a load of chips here. Oh. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> funny make. Funny. So we literally could not get this knife to break. Time to give it a few shots. 20, to be exact. 20 shots were one shot I had already killed a lot of knives in the past. YouTube, I just want to remind you that this is a private terrain. Yeah? Uh, Two professionals, 30 meters distance, controlled area, you know how it goes. Oh. Okay, all the YouTube guidelines are followed. Three, two, one. <laughs> I think this knife handled it with ease. Uh, we Whoa. never given a knife this shit treatment. <laughs> oh, yo. Oh, that's the coating gone. Holy shit. But it had nothing. Dead. It has nothing from it. Absolutely nothing. What a beast. What a Absolutely beast. Be absolute beast. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to say, go check our giveaway. Whoa, Mickey, we are giving away the Lion Steel T6 in Cave 490 thanks to Blade HQ. We are giving away the Falk Neven Modern Body Bowie, Mickey, thanks to us, DBK Boys. Oh, those are cool guys. We are giving away the Mighty Extrema Ratio AMF that we made a video about, thanks to Extrema Ratio, actually. We are also giving away the Letterman Charge Plus, thanks to Tools for Gents. Whoa. And we're giving away the Civivi Ki5 or whatever. Ki5. Thanks, Civivi. I, for this whole video, I know, I knew what I was going to say about this. Okay. Knife, I don't think I have ever encountered a beast like this knife. Yeah. It isn't really a knife. No, because it's too. Can you, can you make a fire with this? Yeah, you can. Yeah. But as a knife, uh, as a traditional knife, it would be a shit yeah. knife. But you know, I think Kbar has it on the right end because they call it a tech tool. They don't call it like the tech knife. Mickey, you know where I would put this knife? Probably in the back of my car or whatever. Or maybe not in the back of my car, but in my car. You know, you can smash your window, cut your seat belt, pry open your door. This it's knife exactly is, that. This knife is so versatile, I would use it as a car. <laughs> yeah. I want to thank Kbar and BowieEvents.be for giving us this knife to test out. Um, yeah, because they didn't sponsor us, they, yeah, they, they gifted gave it, it to me. Yeah. And I, I have to be honest, Okay, they, 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 they gave it to you, nice. You have an extra knife now. No, right? no. <laughs> yeah, congratulations, my friend. They gifted it to us. Yeah. And I'm very glad that they did because otherwise I would have never bought it. No, no. Because it is bad and bad ugly. Yeah. I do want to say but, one thing. Yeah. With okay. minor adjustments, they could have made this knife better. A sharp spine or something that could scrape fire steel. Yeah. This uh, thing here, to cut maybe a piece of rope or to yeah. cut your seatbelt, it doesn't really work that well. No, it's not that so sharp. So is it perfect? No, it certainly isn't perfect. No. Is it a beast and is it very fun to have for everybody looking for yeah. this knife? Yeah, it is. It is this, 10 out of 10 I beast. think this is the crowbar with an edge. Like the yeah. ultimate crowbar with an edge. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, I uh, hope you like this video. We did our best for you guys. Yeah. Watch us every Thursday 1 p.m. PDT. Hey, and I'm, I, don't, I don't like saying this, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Please like, give a comment for the algorithm. Because it sucks, hey. And by compound in our rap show. Oh yeah. Um, 1 p.m. PDT every Thursday. Uh, see you later, ladies and gents. Bye.